Hey Archer Nurses, this week we're talking all about the musculoskeletal system. Let's kick things off with a question of the week. You have a client in a CPM machine, that stands for Continuous Passive Motion. So what's the primary purpose of this machine? Pause here and decide what your answer is. Did you say B? That's correct. A continuous passive motion machine is going to be worn postoperatively after a client has had some sort of joint surgery. It continuously flexes and extends their joints, which helps reduce scar tissue formation and maintain optimal joint mobility. Now, let's look at those other answer choices. A was stabilizing the knee joint. Is a CPM machine going to stabilize the knee joint? Not really. Remember, it is continuously moving that joint. If we need stabilization, we would go for something like a brace or a splint. Now, what about C, reducing swelling? CPM machines really don't function to reduce swelling. Postoperatively, we do want to do this and we may prescribe ice or compression therapy and of course rest to help reduce that swelling. Lastly, D, preventing blood clots. A CPM machine actually might help with this a little bit, but it's not the primary function. Again, the primary function of that machine is continuous motion so that we reduce scar tissue formation and promote optimal mobility. Great job, Archer Nurses. If this question was helpful, make sure to follow along with us all week at Archer NCLEX and head over to archerreview.com to try out our practice question bank for free.